Um, thank goodness for the snow. It was a reminder, no matter how old you became and how much you'd seen, things could still be new if you were willing to believe they mattered. Now that's huge, no matter what age you are. It matters. If it matters to you, it matters. If it matters to the ones you, you care for, it matters. Things matter. Things matter. Snowflakes are the world's most fragile of the nature's things. But just look. Look what they can do when they all, all the snowflakes stick together. Magical. I'll never outgrow the excitement of looking at, out the window and seeing the first snowfall. I lived in Wisconsin, so our first snowfalls were like huge, huge deals, you know, to kids. We don't really get very many snow days. Um, and we're expected the weather, so... You know, we, I grew up living like that my whole life. Uh, I'm the majority of it as of right now. I, I remember seeing pictures of me all bundled up. With a smile. such evidence I just witnessed magic. So here in Virginia it snowed the other day, so reminded me reminded me of Wisconsin. And the blessings that may lie there still. Blessings that may grow there. Still, it made me reminisce. Not much, but it made me realize and remember that some people are worth melting for. For me personally, and I see it in my son, an adventure in the snow always, not always, because I don't really like using the vocabulary of the words always and never but majority of the time after a good event full adventurous afternoon in the snow was followed by hot chocolate which just always made personally me made me feel warm and like I just received a big old hug so all in all it's a good thing the term snow and for its existence. I mean, the simple fact that, the simple fact of snow is such an amazement beauty. We all are winners. We all must live, we all must portray, we all must let it be known that we are winners and we have what it is, that capableness to be winners. Winners are not people who never fail, but people who never quit. I'm gonna introduce you to one right here. And I want it to be loudly known. I like, I enjoy campfires and campfires and marshmallows. Well, I believe that community I stick together like campfires and marshmallows. 
we're just better together. So, like campfires and marshmallows. Could you imagine possibilities? How much better together we, we could show the world? So I'm here to do, try to do, try to do. Mainly for them. It's my world. New for the generation to teach the generation. If you have children, you know that you do anything for them. I am doing that and then some for I'm doing what is right. I'm doing what should be right. I'm doing what is right when it is not being done right. I'm doing this for my community. I'm doing this for a view in what I live. What it's like to live with the life I live today. What it felt to be discriminated against. that it's real, that it's happening by the ones that, I mean, offhand you wouldn't think that it is, but the ones that I'm receiving such hatred from are the same ones that are trying to run a Black Life Matter parade, let's just say. Yeah, racism is real, but let's, let's know where it lies before we discuss it or have a prayed about it. I've filed complaints. I've gotten so far. I've seen people... Come. I've seen people go. No explanation of anything. When it's my business to know. Been promised such treatment and getting the exact opposite. My children were threatened. From me, the only existence of my existence, the only reason I succeed and thrive hard, my hardest, <laughs> I've gotten threats. been in harassing situations all documented yeah I'm still fighting through something that I shouldn't be fighting through I pay rent just why if anything just why am I feeling this way and you're getting away with it The struggle is real. Help me through mine. And we'll see it through together.